Oh, we've got some trainers. A collaboration with Carefree and Mizuno. Um, I actually know the guy that runs Carefree, so big up Damien for these. I didn't actually know there was his brand at first. I kind of just saw them or high beast and thought, oh, these are flipping amazing. Um, you've got the classic '90s colorway on a Mizuno, which I've been, I've been um, a fan. I've been kind of keeping an eye on what Mizuno have been doing. They've been retroing some really, really great runner shape from you know from their archives. They've been putting out really expertly done. They've really paid attention to the idea of re when you re when you retro an old shoe, try and at least you know get the shape right. If you can't get the materials or you can't get the you know the colors right, at least get the shape of it right. So you have that nice classic flat ninety silhouette. So it's not pointing up like a banana like Nike used to do back in the day with their retros. So they're really taking care of their uh, retros and how they're bringing them out and dropping them you know incrementally here and there. And I guess um, this is a great way to do it, you know, collaborating with a smaller brand in Carefree um, and then using it as a way to kind of introduce the market to this Mizuno Sky Medal. Um, brilliant, brilliant, brilliant shoe, man. It, it reminds me of the bad kind of day when you first saw an Asex Gel Light. You remember when that was a new shape, you're like, damn. And I think this is up there. It's really, really beautiful. It'll be, it's a shame because a lot of sneaky kids, you know, these days, they tend to all buy the same models, you know, Jordan 1s, Yeezys and stuff. Um, if, you know, it, all it takes is one one of those cool kids that everyone follows online to wear a pair of these and they'll completely blow up. But I'm happy that people are not kind of paying that much attention to them because it means I'll be able to get them easier. But they're really nice, man. Mizuno Sky Medals, this article here from Hypebeast, that said Damien Malentine, uh, London-based label. Carefree has combined with its label aesthetic with Mizuno's heritage to create a fittingly 90s uh, Sky Medal sneaker. The Mizuno Sky Medal is constructed from a mixture of white leather and Jasper green, which I'm also been a fan of. And that sort of Ke Jasper Kelly green sort of colorway on a 90s shoe is just like beautiful. And mesh um, synthetic materials that appear in bright colors. Uh, Malentine. Mal Malontai has made the pair look as original as possible. The toe box is finished in white mesh. The Mizuno logo on the side serves plenty of the retro fills with its glossy fading red colorway. And even the campaign imagery uses 90s silhouette. Yeah, that is actually, sorry, it looks really cool, man. It reminds me of those, in those old uh, catalog pictures you'd see in like Japanese magazines or, mag or athletic store magazines or something. Really cool. It continues as on a rear sneaker you'll find the carefree signature logo which i'm always a big fan of the little logo on the back from the brand uh while the um aglets with the finished black branding the embroidered mizuno branding blah, 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 blah. take a look at the carefree mizuno medal pairs are available and my websites now while stocks last um further info releases will come via the raffle at hanon and btsn the carefree mizuno sky medal reaches at 120 such a good shoe man it's already out at the moment definitely check them out and support the guy man because that's a brilliant 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 shoe mizuno carefree there sky medal